It's pretty simple, really. I'm the uh, local rep for ChristianMingle.com. Uh, recently, we've got some reports of people not acting very Christian on dates. So, uh, new company policy. Now, whenever anyone registers for the site, uh, they send me over to the house, and I just do a quick look around, ask them a few questions just to make sure they're Christian. Hey, uh, Brittany, I'm with uh, Christian Mingle. We just got your application. No, what do you mean? I didn't sign up for Christian Oh, yeah, Mingle. one of your friends signed you up as a joke. Okay, everybody says that. And uh, when did you get saved? I think 12, maybe. Youth Camp First Baptist Church. Okay, and uh, do you still go there? Yes, but it's not called First Baptist. Oh, so that's something more like trending now. It's like Mosaic or Cross Point or like Watermark. Thrive Church, actually. Yeah, you walk into the building, you're not sure if it's a church or a banana republic. Hey, Chad, I'm with Christian Mingle. We just got your application. I just need to come over quick, ask you a few questions. Well, well, just take a look around the house. Hey, just make sure everything's good. Okay, well, Is this even legal? Pretty fast Wi-Fi you got here. You got a filter on this thing? I'm gonna give you a mainstream band. You give me the Christian equivalent. Justin Timberlake? Toby Mac. Katy Perry. Francesca Battistelli. Uh, Nickelback. Uh, Skillet? Okay, and uh, Switchfoot. Switchfoot. If I could just get a couple of dates of attendance for you here, just for background. Uh, Choir of the Fire? 98. Uh, True Love Waits? 2000. Promise Keepers? 04. Passion Conference? 2010. And Catalyst? Pre-registered last week. Uh, anything information we need to know in here? Oh, what do we have here? That's going to be a problem. While I was having a look around, I did find your phone. You took my phone? Yeah, just a couple things quick I want to go over with you. Looking at here, uh, Tinder and Snapchat are on page one, and your Bible app is on page two in a folder, and it needs to be updated. Look, Google Plus? I mean, Christian or not, Who's using Google Plus? In 2011, I noticed that you favorited a tweet with a swear word. Okay. Mission trips? Uganda, 2009. Dominican Republic, 2011. Oh. And World Race, 2013. Okay, so two? No, that's three. Okay, the World Race. Uh, I'm talking about real mission trips. We don't count church-sponsored sightseeing tours. Oh, what do we got here? That's gonna be a problem. We've heard it all recently. We've got reports of people going to R-rated movies. Hold on, Left Behind, is this the Kirk Cameron version? I don't think so. Okay. We've heard of people not praying before meals. Let's say you're a nice young Christian woman and we're on the Christian mingle date. Things are going well and we're back at your place eating popcorn and watching Fireproof. Is this okay? Yeah. Okay, love the book collection. Uh, these candles are a little too Catholic-y for me. What about this? Sure. No! And Michael's or Hobby Lobby? Hobby Lobby. And Ulta or Sephora? Sephora. Wrong. Trick question. Christians shouldn't be that concerned with outward appearances. Are you serious? Walgreens is fine. Target, maybe. Spirit, lead me where my trust is without borders. Love's like a hurricane. I am a tree. I can't feel my face when I'm with you. But I love it. Well, you shouldn't love it, and you shouldn't know that song. Is that safe for the whole family? I don't think so. I'm going to be real honest with you, Brittany. Uh, I just, I'm not seeing the fruit. I don't know what else I can tell you. I... I volunteer at a soup kitchen on Thanksgiving. I work in the church nursery every week. I got a Bible verse tattooed on my shoulder. In Hebrew. Okay, Republican or Democrat? Republican. Global warming. No evidence. Stem cell research. Don't know what it is, but I'm against it. Guns. Love them. Obama. Hate him. Welcome to Christian Mingle. I mean, I hear what you're saying, and on paper, things look great, but uh, I gotta be real honest with you. Uh, yoga pants? Like, I... Personally, I just don't see how someone could be a Christian and wear yoga pants. If there's anything I can do to prevent someone from a life of destruction, and I feel like my work here is done. And I'm out of here. And don't even bother reapplying until you get rid of those yoga pants, get some Don Miller books added to that collection, you get a letter from a compassion child up on that fridge, okay?